Right now in Medical Rounds, big news in the world of pacemakers. The world's smallest pacing device, about the size of a vitamin, if you can believe that, is now on the market. And Hartford Hospital is one of a few places selected to implant that device. Dr. Steven Zweibel is the System Director of Cardiac Electrophysiology at the Hartford Healthcare Heart and Vascular Institute. Hi, doctor. Thank you very much for joining us. Hi, thank you for having me. Let me ask you first, how was Hartford Hospital selected to be one of the first to implant this device? And I think if I'm saying it correctly, it's the Micro AV. Yes, it's the, the Micro AV device. And I'm actually proud to announce that we were the first center in Connecticut to implant the Micro AV about an hour ago. Uh, my colleague, Dr. Oh. Crespo, performed the procedure and the patient actually did quite well. This is the procedure, right, the uh, device right here. Uh, we were chosen by Medtronic uh, to be one of the first centers to implant this device because we have a good history with Medtronic. We do a lot of research with the company on their devices, um, and we have implanted a lot of the first generation leadless micro device. About an hour ago. This is incredible. This is breaking news right now, doctor. That's fantastic. <laughs> yes, it I, is. I understand this uh, micro AV, as you just said, it's a leadless pacemaker. Talk about what that mm -hmm. is. Sure, so a, a traditional pacemaker is implanted typically through the upper chest with leads or wires that connect the pacemaker into the heart, and that's how we pace and sense the heart. The leadless pacemaker, as its name would uh, tell you, is, has no leads. We actually implant it from a vein in the leg up into the heart, and the actual entire pacemaker uh, sits inside of the lower chamber of the heart really is incredible when you see the progress. Uh, you're talking right yeah. now, of course, about this micro AV, but how is that different from the micro device? So the initial micro device is a device that we use to pace the lower chambers of the heart, typically in patients who do not need any pacing in the upper chambers of the heart, usually in atrial fibrillation. So it really does not take into account what is going on in the upper chambers. The micro AV device, on the other hand, can actually sense when the upper chambers of the heart are contracting and can time pacing in the lower chambers of the heart to the contraction in the upper chamber. So it makes the upper and lower chambers of the heart speak well together. Doctor, I have to ask you quickly, if you could just say, are there certain patients who have to meet a condition to have this new micro AV implanted? Yep, so uh, most of the patients we'll be implanting will have a, a condition called heart block that doesn't typically require pacing in the upper chambers, but does require coordination in the upper and lower chambers. And we think we're gonna have a, a, a large number of patients who really will benefit from leadless pacing. All right, that is incredible. And our best right now to the patient that just had this procedure done. That's nice to hear. Dr. Zweibel, yeah, thank, thank you. you very much for joining us and sharing this technology right now. If anyone at home wants more information, call this number 833-444-0014.